Hey again guys, Ryan with the MXG channel. Quick video here. Uh, just did a video updating you guys about Triumph and what they announced at the MX of Nations. So now I've got to do my rounds and tell you about what Beta was doing there. They showed their new 450 RX motocrosser. Now we've known that Beta is going to get involved with motocross and supercross uh, for a while now. They've been hitting at this for a few years. They came out with the 300 uh, RX two-stroke motocrosser, which is super cool, limited quantities, and they've been developing their 450 RX in the MXGP series. Obviously, there's no production rules over there, so they can kind of change up that bike every round, get it dialed in, things they can't do in the US. But you got your first look at the pre-production model of the 450 RX at Moto uh, Motocross of Nations last weekend at Redbud. Motocross Action did an interview with Carlin Gardner and he tells them how the bike is similar to the current 430 and 480 they offer as far as width and length and stuff like that. But the engine is a completely different uh, setup that they've been developing and uh, that the pre-production model was you know, pretty close to what we're going to see, but we're going to see orders for it in uh, early 23, and the bike is going to come out as an early 2024 model. So he said orders and bike ar bike arriving in the showroom in early 2023. That's pretty exciting because that's only, what, three or four months away? So pretty pumped to hear that. He also uh, let a little bit slip that if everything goes as planned, we might see this bike in Supercross in 2024. And that would be sweet. Uh, I haven't heard any information about if they're going to do a 250, um, you know, but I think they went the right direction with developing the 450 first. I think it's easier to develop a 450 that can compete than it is a 250. And Triumph surprisingly has been going the opposite direction. They're doing the 250 first and then going to the 450. So it's interesting. We'll see which one works out. But it does sound like Beta is going to be in the U.S. racing before Triumph. So either way, we want both of these motorcycle manufacturers in the U.S. and in MXGP. It just means more rides, more money. Um, and we need all that we can get, especially with what's coming down the pipeline with this recession. So, um, yeah, can't wait to see what Beta and Triumph bring to the table. Uh, keep you guys posted. We will be getting a, um, a Beta 450 RX here at AOMC at some point. And, of course, I'll do a walk around and check it out with you guys. Thanks so much. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. I'll keep you guys up to date. I'm Ryan with the MXG channel. See you in the next video.